Good morning, everyone. Uh, Teresa Fuller, D Music Mix Daily, day four. I can't even talk, that's because it's day four. No, yeah, I feel that. <laughs> right? Yeah, I think we both feel about the same way right now. I'm here with Olivia Ohms, 16. Yeah. Um, so put together, so beautiful. I love the Thank dress. You. Thank you very Have much. Have you had a blast at CMA Fest? Yes, it's been so fun. This is my second time at CMA Fest. So very cool. Definitely have learned the ropes a little bit more, mm -hmm. you know, getting more comfortable with it, but it's very fun. And you've had an exciting year. Um, so the first question I want to mm -hmm. ask is how was it to sing Delta Dawn with Tanya Tucker? That was crazy to think that was <laughs> almost a year ago was insane because it feels like it was just yesterday. Yeah. And she was so sweet. I met her very briefly before she went on stage to do her set because I actually opened up for her right. at the event in Kentucky. And then randomly on stage, nobody knew. Um, she didn't tell anybody. It was just oh. her little surprise. Oh, she was is. like, all right, Olivia Ohms to the stage. And I was in the trailer eating ice cream with my friends. <laughs> and then my publicist like, <laughs> slams open the door and it's like Olivia get on stage and I was like what and then I just next thing I knew I was on stage singing with her to oh her Lord. hit song that yeah it was incredible yeah, I'm getting goosebumps right now because that's just amazing yeah she's incredible that's great and you've you've had some other you know great people that you've been able to open for mm -hmm. and, and hang out with um tell me tell me a fun story besides that one you have any fun like Oh, fun stories about people that I've opened up for. Yeah, any fun shenanigans or anything like that? I, th I mean, I think that was definitely my my highlight. The really. highlight, yeah. yeah. Um, I'll tell you a fun, I guess, fun band story. Oh yeah, because sure. I have a band that I play with back home, and. I think it's funny because before we go on stage, you know, usually the people that you play in a band with will like pump you up and be like, all right, let's do this. You guys, you got this. Yeah. But they make sure, because they're my best friends and oh, there are nice. four other guys that I play with and they're like my brothers. Yeah. Sorry, Chandler, my <laughs> actual brother. If you're <laughs> Still love you. Um, <laughs> but they're like my other brothers. And so they'll just like tease me a bunch to kind of humble me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then when I get on stage, I just, we have a good time. So I think it's funny because usually your bandmates will like pump you up, but instead they kind of tease me and make fun of me. Nice. <laughs> Nice. That's awesome. I don't know. Yeah. Um, so I have, well, almost teens. I have a 16 year old son, okay. and then I have a 12 year old uh -huh. daughter. Do you have any other siblings besides your brother? Just my older brother, who's yeah. 20. Yeah. yeah. So, um, and I like when I talk to, especially young female artists that are up and coming, and like I said, you are obviously a confident young lady and put together. What kind of things um, do you like to do to like encourage young ladies as they're coming out into the world? Um, you know, like like a song that you've written or something that would um, help those young girls out there understand that they don't have to listen to social media or, you know, the magazines. I mean, I, yeah, I, I love female empowerment because I think it's so important. One of the mottos that I live by is find something you're good at and be the best at it. Mm -hmm. And even if you're not the best of out of everyone, you can't really, it's really hard to be the best out of anyone right. because there's so many people to compare yourself to. But just to keep working so hard and to to get really good at that craft and be so confident in that. That's amazing. And I have this new song coming out. Um, still in the works, but it's called Baggage. And it's kind of like the message is this is all the things that come with me. Mm -hmm. And this is all my flaws that some people may not like, but I love. And they're not going anywhere because it's a part of me. And so it's kind of... Oh, I love that. It's, it's a funny message because it's like I got a lot of baggage, but it's, it's saying... This baggage isn't going anywhere. It's yeah. here to stay, and it's here with me. I love so. that. I've, I, right. That's one of the things. Oh, that, yeah, <laughs> that's one of the things I always hold. I don't regret anything I've ever done in yeah. my life because I, I've, it's made me the person yeah, I am. Yeah, exactly. So, and that's great. That's a really great song. <laughs> what single do you have out now? Um, well, I have my EP out. Oh, um, awesome. it came out a while ago, but it's called Thoughts of You EP, and there's five songs on it, and that's available Spotify, mm -hmm. iTunes, Apple Music, YouTube, everywhere. Um, but I do have a new song coming out at the end of the month, which oh. I'm super excited about. Very cool. I've played it at almost every show that I've done so far this weekend. It's called California Country. Ooh, nice. And it's the perfect embodiment of who I am as a person and an artist. And it's kind of like that 90s country vibe with mm -hmm. a little bit of a pop twist to it but still grounded in those classic country roots. So nice. super excited about it and I'm really excited to hear and, what people think. And when does it come out? At the end of the month. There's, I don't have an exact date. Yet, okay, okay. Definitely soon and uh, you guys will. And where can they find you to figure that out yeah. when it does drop? I'll, I'll be announcing it on all my social media. It's uh, just at the Olivia Ohms. 
My last name is spelled O O M S. Awesome. We're gonna play a little game. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I heard about this game uh, and see, I was I like, I was waiting for. I love playing games in interviews. <laughs> I love it when people have heard about it before they get to our booth. Um, I played it with uh, Big Smo. Okay. Oh my gosh. So much fun because he's got the biggest personality uh -huh. in the world, and it, it was just hilarious. Yeah. But anyways, so um, you pick a card. If you read it to yourself and you don't like it, you can put it down and give you a new one. Um, but you read it and you'll know what you need to do. It's it, it, so you'll pick the song that goes with the card. It can be any song, any genre, whatever. Oh. Do I sing it? No, you don't have oh, to sing okay. it. No, just read the card out loud and tell us what song. Oh. If you want to sing it, you okay. can. <laughs> Best song for 4th of July barbecue, Party in the USA. Oh, yeah. Totally. Awesome. Oh, nice. Look at that. She's great at this. <laughs> All right. One more. Maybe. Maybe two more. What is the most American blue collar sweating hard work quitting time old truck montage song? <laughs> hmm. American blue... <laughs> Um, um, beta hook. Beta hook. Who's that? Um, I don't, I don't, I, I don't want to oh, get the oh, artist yeah, on. Yeah. She oh, can't okay. even beta hook. Yes. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. I, that's the first one that came to my mind. <laughs> All right. One more. Okay. Have you ever wanted to drive really fast? What is your go-to drive fast song? Tokyo Drift. <laughs> Perfect. Do Perfect. you know that song? Yes. <laughs> but you're only 16. No <laughs> tickets, Missy. Okay? <laughs> no, I'm totally kidding. I. That's, yep. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, Olivia. It's been great. And have a rest, uh, what, safe trip home. Thank you. And enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you so much. You as well. It's nice talking to you. <laughs>